What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Jay's Retro Footwear. I'm Jay, and I uh, I managed to pick up something at my local sneaker shop, and I'm excited to share with you guys. Um, excuse the voice. It's a little hoarse and whatnot. I'm feeling a little bit under the weather, but I am okay. And I got checked out by the doctor, so I should be all right. So anyways, getting back to the video. Uh, into the shoe here. Um, I have here a Nike Dunk High. Um, it is an orange, orange, deep royal blue. This one is a size 11, men, and a 12 and a half in a woman. All right. Ladies, babies, you take your uh, typical tissue paper, uh, take typical stamping on the inside right here. Set this aside. All right. So, yeah, here they are, side by side. Very nice, very clean, orange on orange with a deep royal blue. Very nice. If you haven't recognized these colors or this pattern, then I will inform you, and this is the New York Knicks colorway, the basketball team. Uh, which, incidentally, these are nicknamed the Knicks. Very clean. Beautiful shoe, real, real solid color blocking all the way around, orange bottoms here, the soles, very nice. I like, I like what they did, they, they combined the, the, the white with the orange, very clean. Because you'll get shoes that you can do all types of com combinations with and, and the white just looks Either the, either the white will outperform the colors or it'll underperform. And in this case, I think it just really makes it pop. It only comes with one uh, lace, I believe. Yep, I don't see no extra laces, none in the box either. So it just comes with the blue laces. Orange, Nike on the tongue there. Really nice overall. Really good leather. Really hard leather too. Very smooth. Uh, really hard. I think they could have done a little bit better. It's, it's nice. But they could have done better with the leather. Or is it a leather? I mean, it feels like a leather. Almost feels like it's fake, but it's a very hard leather. Yeah, yeah, it's a leather. Yeah, genuine leather. But again, you know, sock liner is typical. Tongue is really thin. Obviously, also typical from a Nike Dunk. The insole has the Nike logo on it. Let me see if I can pull it out. Bear with me, folks. Be careful I don't tear, tear it up. There we go. Look at that. That glue is in there. Nope, nope. It's in there. I might be able to pull it up far enough so you can see. Hopefully that shows up on camera right there. Nice orange colorway. Again, typical to dunks for some reason is instead of putting a cardboard shoe tree. Wow. They put this paper one in there. 
And that is a problem with these dunks. That dunks tend to crease pretty quickly because uh, they have no real um, they have they have no real stuffing to hold a structure up when you're putting them away. So you need to be careful how you store these. Um, I did a video a while back. Um, typical of little stuff. It comes back pretty quickly. But I did a video on a um, Supreme Nike Dunk. Uh, one of my earlier videos. And the leather was just buttery soft. Compared to this one, this one feels like it's uh, plastic. Even though I know it's uh, leather. But all in all, quality is good. Stitching is on point. I don't see no uh, stitching starting to fray or come up or come loose. Um, yeah. You know, all in all, it's just a simple shoe modeled after the uh, New York Knicks colorway. And very clean, very nice, very, very nice shoe. A lot of people are going to have their ups and downs about it, but, you know, I think, um, you know, this is a very summer vibe shoe. Some shorts and nice shirt, and you're good to go. Black and orange, jeans, you know, however you want to set yourself up. But this shoe is really, really nice. I managed to get a couple of these. I ended up getting this size 11. I uh, also ended up getting a size 10 and a half, 11 and a half, or two 11 and a halves. And um, yeah, they went as fast as I got them. And I managed to keep this one. Somebody came through looking for this one, the last pair that I had, but um, not a Knicks fan. But I do like sports memorabilia and stuff like that. And I just figured, I'd, you know, I'd keep these. Uh, let them stick around. Because some, the, some of the Knicks stuff are pretty expensive. But I actually wanted this one for the personal to add to my collection. I don't really have any dunks. Um, every time I get a dunk, I get rid of it. Um, but yeah. It is pretty cool. I like them a lot. Well, there you have it. This is the Nike Dunk High Retro Nick. Or Nicks. I like them. They're pretty, pretty dope. Anyways, enough of my rambling. I just wanted to show you, share the video with you guys, and uh, um, share with you my passion for shoes. Um, anyways, uh, thanks. Have a good one. Don't forget to uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. Um, yeah, hope you enjoyed it. A uh, little short video here. And um, yeah, till the next one. Later.